Hello boys and girls, welcome to peek over my shoulder in Call of Pripyat Special Edition. I've just been through a little bit of a panic. Not because of the blowout, but because uh, uh, a few days ago I installed a new shiny uh, hard drive and I've been migrating all my essential folders to it while keeping zip duplicates on the old one just in case. And and while while migrating uh, my games folder, I realized that all the stalker mods were in the folder that I was currently zipping up. Uh, fortunately, it doesn't uh, concern Call of Pripyat because I had installed this one uh, manually, but. Uh, Oblivion Lost and Arsenal mods for uh, for Shadow of Chernobyl were <laughs> in the in the folder that I uh, destroyed. So yes, there will be some uh, some housekeeping, some further housekeeping is needed there. Who lit the fire there? The zombies. I must investigate. So let's uh, have a munchie on the road. Oh, and also since it's after blowout, I should be ready to loot anything anywhere. Especially when I get around uh, campsites. See, the moment I set my foot on Saturn, I have already forgotten why I came here and I'm already like, oh, loot! Artifacts! Well, I mean, I, I did plan to do an artifact round, so there is that. What do we have there? Moves like a zombie fight. Also, what's up with the frame rate issue here? Is it the rain? I hear no beep. Seems to me that the lights are on but nobody's home. Or maybe we're not in the range yet. Okay, somebody is there. But who? Well, nobody's by the fire. I, I seem to remember this. Uh, this folklore bit, local folklore, I mean, not uh, not zone folklore, that uh, if you build a fire in the woods at night, you cannot let it go unattended, otherwise, uh, uh, otherwise the devil will come and sit by it. Well, not the devil, devil, but our local version of our local schmuckier version of the devil or, or some. Let's say forest spirit will come and sit by it. That's a little bit more accurate, I think. I do not want to chase that lone zombie, so I will just leave it be. Instead, I will go here. Check all the places for artifacts. Oh, and also, I remembered one uh, biggie. 
that uh, might also contribute to the game breaking actions. So I want to check uh, what's the status with the lab door. Because when I was uh, when I was first on uh, when I was in the ton before moving out, I kept uh, visiting the lab. Uh, lab, what's it called? X seven. That's why nobody's home. The the lab by the uh, iron forest, I mean. I kept visiting it, hoping that the door would uh, yank itself open, but it didn't. So, if these guys are all dead, then whose signal am I picking up? Let us loot. Somebody must have looted them already. Okay, I left this pistol here. These pistols. The road seems empty. There's a bundle on the road, probably some more dead guys. Let's go check them before somebody else gets to them. Oh, okay. Hello. First you take the loot, then you take the artifacts, eh? I don't think so. <laughs> okay, crap first. And sort later. Oh my god, I won't, won't be able to move now. Can I move now? Okay, yeah, let's move by the side of the road. Off the main path. Now, let's see, what did we get? A lot. This one's in good condition. This one too. Okay, I think I'm gonna switch to Beretta. Even though I don't have too much of its ammo, but eh. Now let's go back and sell some of the stuff back to that guy. What was my weight now? 69! Let's keep the gravy on chest for good measure. I am the scavengest of the scavengers. Four. Oh, another squad is arriving. Oh, wait. Ну типа я слушаю. Если тебе перетереть что надо, вон тебе пахан. They don't pay as well as loners do. Also, if they are here, what happened to the loner? Со всеми вопросами валик бригадный. I don't think they just let him leave. But then again, oh, he's over there. Well, what do you know? Yo, dude, 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 dude. Okay, let's put some protection on now.
What you're doing? Oh, he's... He's... Uh, how should I say it? He's rich! Also, which part is this? Fourth... Go! Ah! Dude! Stand still, I want to do business. Uh, I want to sell the excess ammo to him. Uh, also... No, 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 no. Anti-rat and... Why? What's happening? Okay, let's see... Do I have extra... Oh, now I know why I had that wrenched on me. Because of extra... Extra protection. Extra anti-rat protection. Do I have anything else I could sell to him? I don't think so. Okay, show me your books. Pseudo dog, got it. And fourth part of the picnic. I think I already have fourth part, so nope. I admit I kind of like this place. These uh, complex anomaly fields where you have combination of several things. Whoa! Mutants coming up. Why do I get radiated so much? Is the is the bubble not enough for a meat chunk? Oh. Ow. Maybe maybe that's um, some pills. Yeah, and I don't really. Oh, it's because of the water. Duh. It's one of the local flavors of uh, special edition, isn't it? The water is extra radiated. here because sometimes I do drop stuff here okay no not that of the moment no so what else oh I see dots I know where they are they are at the at the uh, pine oak. What's it in Russian? The snoop? Or maybe they're not even that far. I think they're at the thingy, this thingy, pumping station or whatever. Uh, this thingy's yard. No. Then I think they're at the pine oak because I was looking when I was on the ground oh there's also the other campsite in between isn't there so the stash was in my map when I saw them and What else? Okay, let's get closer. 
I think the pine oak estimate was correct, maybe. Sometimes I have difficulty having a good sense of directions or dis distances and or. But I'm certain I saw a bunch of grey dots. Well, there is another bunch here, so there's that. I don't think I've searched them yet. Look at your surroundings, don't get cocky. Let me just take the ammo. And food. I will leave the vodka because uh, it adds a lot to the weight. Also, somebody else can have that mutant eye. I think the dots that I saw might not have been bodies, but but uh, part of the terrain, maybe. No, no, I'm not sure anymore. Because I know that sometimes the map elements kind of give you the wrong impression. But there definitely was a stash in the view, so let's see, let me try to go to the same-ish place. So I was about here, on the ground. really safe to do the little around out in the open like this. Yeah, I think I might have been fooled by other map elements. So let's go to a known campsite. <coughs> Sorry. That was a very good sneeze. Rather cathartic, I would say. I wasn't trying to put it away, I was just trying to look around. Show some more awareness and such. because the map is illuminated from behind. Mm, seems clear. What about artifacts? I'm not 
not exactly thorough right now, but I'm just sort of doing a quick sweep. Quick sweep on the sides. Uh oh, who's there? And where? Where is there? Zombified on the campsite. also care about is are there any dead bodies on the campsite? Is he shooting now? Really, whom? Zombie fight don't usually hunt mutants or like so I seem to remember. So who was he shooting? <laughs> Hello. Yoink. Ah, so one of them dropped their uh, dropped their gun and the other picked it up before moving on. Easier. Also, such a lag here. Is it? Is it because of the weather? That's kind of, kind of uh, foggy. I think that might uh, might have something to do with it. I do hope that my background processes don't interfere with the game too much. here I mean somebody has thrown a bucket there is that burning so I don't think anybody's at the campsite. Oh you I think if I'm staying farther away then it's throwing radius is not as great. Or like it's it's punches are not as potent. I don't know if that's actually how it is. I'm just sort of applying some magical thinking here now. I mean, that's what stalkers do. There's a whole lot of magical thinking going on. <laughs> well. 
where are you? Fighting some dogs, are we? is actually blocking me. Okay, now I hit it. The uh, the thing with poltergeist is that uh, their hitbox it is a little bit off, or like they 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 aren't where you think you they are. So you have to aim a little bit off. Ow. Yeah, let's just shoot from the hip, won't we? Because that's worked so well in the past. Shit. <laughs> yes, this was not very... Oh, ooh, let's... Oh, I was hoping to watch some of the post-death animation and watch him throw shit around. Thing is, I've been uh, playing some Doom 3 lately, so the whole shooting from the hip tends to come naturally, too naturally even. Wait, I want to check something. Okay. Since I'm keeping the heart off, I don't uh, necessarily know all the time which uh, fire mode is on. <laughs> I'm gonna try to approach more from this side now so that uh, there wouldn't be so much litter around. Of course there might be other mutants here like bloodsuckers and such. But oh, also taking cover in irradiated boxes might not be the brightest idea. Hello. Wall. 
be the most economical use of ammo, but hey. <laughs> yeah, two magazines. All gone. lower. I'm trying to yeah, free magazine. I'm trying to get the sense of the where where the actual body is. There seems to be some puffs of blood though. Or or are there? Magazines, all for one mutant. Yes, I don't think, I don't think. Okay, so this was a hit. So none, none of the, none of the shots before were hits. I don't think. But of course, I don't. I don't remember now where where exactly I was aiming there. Okay, it's gone. How much ammo do we have left? Shitload, so this flies. Okay, let's take a glancing sweep at the anomaly field, but mostly I'm interested in the door right now. I remember my embuzzlement once when I was diddle daddling something over here and I was looking at the minimap and saw one of the grey dots moving and I was like, what? What? And then I realized that uh, some or other mutant was dragging one of the soldier bodies. Aha! Oh wait, I don't think it's open enough that we can squeeze through. No! Try to pop it. Now you have to throw it with gusto. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Come on. This is the grand tradition of breaking into the encoded tours. Also, there there is a chance that you throw the weapon and it bounces back into you and kills you. There is that. Can I squeeze through? No! <coughs> and they told me it was tired sausage. Lies. is that now that the door is already ajar the same sweet spots don't necessarily apply and and uh, the sense of the sweet spots what works and what doesn't is also subject to magical thinking like the hinges are usually one one place that glitches and there there's also the 
uh, this area with certain doors this seems to be the sensitive uh, sensitive spot but uh, <coughs> come on come on I don't think a grenade will work but let's try it anyway oh no Oops! And we knocked the lights out. Brilliant. <laughs> so apparently we are not really through the door. Oh, now we are. I mean, it is a blast door after all. Okay, the the grenade bit was a bit stupid. Let's. Bask in some healing light. And since we have lost the shotgun anyway, I think let's leave. Wait, not, not what I meant. At least we have cost some property damage. So that's that's like progress, right? Ooh, ooh we have something. We have two somethings. Free! Oh! Oh my! It occurs to me that I might have left some artifacts behind here. What's this? <gasps> Snowflake! Save here. Also check what's my radiation status. It's it's okay. It's okay. Grab that sparkler, just because. And now for the third one. here but it's not showing itself bouncing around though should be in the range now another snowflake oh my Yoink. Mm, let's get back the way we came Well, I would say that the Zaton uh, expedition has been a success. A great success even. I'm a little alarmed that the frame rate is so um, bad. I mean, I didn't have such a stutter in Jupiter, so I don't know what's happening. Is it is it that there are too many stalkers around, too much uh, rain, too much uh, stuff? Sometimes there has been a stray artifact in this field. 
think I found a moonlight from here. Yeah, I think the current stutter is because of the rain. Pretty sure. Rain and foggy weather. I think I've got any beef with these mercs here. I think uh, I've been able to feed them and befriend them and maybe send some mutants to covertly attack them, but I don't think they have beef with me. I mean, I have, I have uh, snuck out the tools, so there's that. Just passing through, so Let's swing by the... No, no, no. Keep it out. Let's swing by the gas station and see what's the status with the dead bodies. Anybody on the road? There are mutants as per usual. probably on the ground. Oh, the frame rate just got better. So uh, there must have been something about that area. I mean, there's still stutter, but it's different now. You know the feeling uh, when you're trying, when you're dreaming, and you're trying to run, and and you like pull in full effort, and it still doesn't work. That's what the frame rate feels like, and then all of a sudden it just eased up a lot. Quick save before. I think it's the pancake or was it stone flower? Yeah, I'm gonna leave it. I already have these. Oops. Yeah, I think let's just let it let it slide. Hmm. What a nice view. This reminds me. Uh, I have gathered a whole bunch of screenshots for a special little side project. Uh, you could call it like li a little crafty project that I've been thinking about. Uh, how, what, what was the number? 26? 36? Let's say 26 screenshots of Taras Sevchenko. And, uh, and the plan is to sort of couple the screenshots with the with the uh, what's the word with the wood woodblock prints of Hokusai <laughs> it's a very dorky project so there is that's the Skotovsk campfire and there's campfire over there oh shit No! I did not want to use up my anti-rad, but I will let it slide. Anyway, my plan is to go and investigate a little further, but this seems like a good place to take a little pause. So, 
polls coming up. Thank you very much for watching. I will see you in the next one. Bye bye.